Hello, everybody. Hello, hello, and welcome back to Crimson Plays uh, or Crimson Night Games or whatever. I don't really care what I'm called, what it called, what, yeah, I don't, yeah. Hi! Welcome back! I hope you all have been having a great day, um, or at least have had a passable day. Um, we are going to be diving back into Watch Dogs 2, right over here. Um, for the first time since I came back from my vacation! So, um, do I have any announcements? Um... No, not really. Not that I could think of. Um, do I have anything else I need to say? Oh, check uh, check my link tree out to find links to my socials, my uh, YouTube, my Patreon, which is also linked right here, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So make sure to check those out if you can. I have a cat licking my leg, as she is wont to do. And she is adorable, but she hates being picked up. I don't like being manhandled. I don't like being handled. I don't like it. I don't like it, she says. I like being scratched though. I like, I like being scratched a lot. Uh, give me just a second. All right. Sorry. I needed to change a window on OBS that I could actually see what I needed to see. All right. Uh, Tasha, I need this hand, baby girl. No, you don't. No, your, your hand, this hand stays here. This hand stays here and keeps scratching me because I am adorable. Uh, you know, they would love seeing you on camera. No, I don't care. I'm walking away now. Okay. So anyway, let's get back into this, shall we? Okay. So where are we? I did a little bit of grinding in this game. Um. Oh. Let's see here. I always love. Sorry, Ubisoft. Ubisoft was getting in the way. Um. You play. I mean, same difference. Uh, we were looking at research. That's what we were looking for. Doing nothing. Don't worry about me. What? Um. But yeah, I did a little bit of a leveling up, as you can see here. Um. Uh. We have the taunt ability. We do. We have the key data for the enhanced spring. We don't have enough research points for it. We have the key data for the speed boost, but we don't have enough research points for it. Um, we have the key data for the remote gadgets for the for our Hilo drone. Uh, but again, not enough research points for it. Um, and so on and so forth. So anyway, wait, uh, dead sec half. That's what we wanted. We wanted to we were going after the cult. That's what we were doing. Uh, that's online, 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 DLC, main operation, here we go, false profits. Uh, show on map is over there, okay. Where am I? I'm all the way over here. Uh, let's fast travel to here. That way we don't have to drive as far. Sorry, I'm reminding myself controls. Okay. Camera up 
Yeah, I'm just I'm just trying to remember my controls and stuff. Car on demand. Uh let's get Get this. Where'd it drop? Right next to me. Cool. Alright. Hey, buddy. Yay! Alright. Over my vacation, I played a lot of Cyberpunk. Uh, well, not a lot, but I played some cyberpunk more cyberpunk than I did this game even though I did a lot of grinding on this game, so we'll see how uh, We'll see how successful I am at divesting my Brain From that Is Hi, who are you? What kind of trouble are you in? We're making oh, yeah. trouble for the church. We who? Dead who do you saved. think? I knew it. I have friends that would love to put dead sec behind bars. Like a good fight? Hey, so did you. Excuse me? Oh, I watched you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with New Dawn back in the day. But, hey, I get it. You a councilwoman now. No, 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 no. You don't get to pull that I sold out crap on me. These assholes wreck lives on a weekly basis. They went public with videos of my surgeries. But here's the thing. I don't give a shit. I got nothing to hide. But you're right. I am a councilwoman now. My hands are tied. That's why you asked me to meet you here. You need my help. Looks like you need mine. Plus, I finish what I start. First of all, don't mistake New Dawn for a church. They are a criminal organization. As are every cult. The records of all the properties they own in the Bay Area. There's one that just doesn't check out. Over there. Hmm. They have it marked as an educational center. Doors are locked. Nobody answers. Security comes and goes. Does that sound like an education center to you? Nah, it sounds like a re-education center. I'll stick around. Go see what you can find. Thanks, Miranda. All right. Let's go poke our nose. Marcus, did you meet with Miranda? I did. We think this is the place, but we don't know what kind of place this is. It's obvious they're hiding something, though. So, I'm gonna see if I can find a computer and snoop around. All right, give me just a second. I need to pop into settings real quick. Double check a couple of things. It didn't feel right. I it felt like I needed to change some things. And so that's what I did. Hello. 
All right. Um, let's not actually enter the area. Let's make it look like we're going down to go see the beach, hey? We're just sitting on the steps. Carrying, and we're just going to be sitting on the steps looking at some, uh, looking at the beach. Yeah? On our computer. Just chilling on the steps. See? Just chilling on the steps, enjoying the beach air on our computer. Checking Facebook and Instagram and shit. Okay, but before we do that, let's also send out our Hilo friend. Hello, buddy. Our flying buddy fly. Flying buddy. Okay, so there's that. Alright, so we got cameras. We are your family. We understand. Trust us. Oh, don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. You saw nothing? shot me or they shot the drone I was out of range anyway so let's um oops let's get back on the path shall we all right um we're gonna sit in the bushes this time They're a little on guard right now. Fine. They're allowed to be. Okay, I want to steal the registry of the doc of the thing. Who are you? Oh, I think that's Jimmy Siska. Okay. Don't worry about the quadcopter. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm fine. We're fine. We're not here. Go Rolo, go go Rolo, buddy. Do 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 do. Oh. Hey, you're getting a call. You should really check out. You got two. Jimmy Siska. <sighs> Looks like you were right. No, Marcus. This is the place, and they brought Jimmy Siska here. If I bust him out, think you can get him someplace safe? Count on it. I'll be ready. Okay. All right.
We are not going to kill anyone. Hey, I'm not going to worry about him. Jason! My name's not Jason, and I'm not with Nudo. I don't belong here, man. You gotta get me out. Get moving, go. Okay, okay. <clears throat> Miranda, Jimmy Siska's headed your way. What about you? I'll get out on my own. Just make sure he's safe. I will. Mind me just you know stealing from a cult it's fine it's how things are, should be Go to sleep, go to sleep, go to sleep, you fucked up. Hey, You're all assholes. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Well, that away. Where's my dirt bike? Did my dirt bike despawn? Yes. Tracking down. Uh, uh, uh. Ooh, I hear a harmonica. Hey, dude. Good job on the harmonica, my man. Ooh, there's a bike. Marcus, I got Jimmy out safe. Thanks, Miranda. Hey, you did all the legwork. Here, he wants to talk to you. Marcus, if that's your name. I want to burn these bastards and I know where to start. I'll meet you outside the Temple of New Dawn. Man, you should file a police report. We just proved the church keeps prisoners. I've got footage. We'll release a video soon to let the world know. What else do we need? I can lead you to the heart of the religion. The holy relics. The original source. Now how am I gonna resist an offer like that? I'll see you there. Now, let us 
hop in here real quick. I have three research points available. Which I believe means I don't have the ability to do any of the things I want to do, right? Right, okay, yeah. Oh my god. All right, uh, map. I want to... All right, let's go. Whoop, that's a truck. I'm mad. My bad. Glad you could make it. Come with me, and we, and you'll see us take down an evil cult that is actually a criminal organization. Whoa! Careful, Marcus. Careful, my dude. Ooh, Scout X location nearby. Rain is not good for cameras. Okay, so because it's raining, I can't do the thing. Fine. Another launch. Da, 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 da. Looks like Galilee's keeping busy. Kid, yeah, it's me. I'm over here. Jimmy Siska. I'm. Oh wow! I, in disguise. I totally yeah, didn't I recognize. Him. Totally didn't recognize him. Beautiful, isn't it? That house is built on lies, and it's time for, for a confession. <laughs> Man, Open Wounds 3, that, that is a modern classic. Classic. I'm sorry, kid, I didn't, I didn't know you were such a fan. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I fucked up, didn't I? Seems to be a running theme in that. There's always time for a fresh start, like right here. Yeah. Right here and right now. Mm -hmm. You know, kid, maybe not right here and right now. I don't know if I can go back in there. Well, it's all good. Just tell me what to look for. I got you. Right. Uh, right. Okay. So uh, there's a lift that will take you down into the basement. In the basement, there's a room. Inside the room. There are ancient Sumerian tablets said to have been written by the visitor himself. No, hey, man, I'm serious. And they, they are deadly serious. Okay, man. No, I believe you. That's perfect. Okay. Look, if you need anything else, you let me know. Okay, gang, I'm about to sneak inside New Dawn's temple. And Jimmy's agreed to deliver a special message for our video. We're all set up once you raid the treasure. Watch out for snakes. There are always snakes. <laughs> it's not that kind of temple, Wrench. That does not preclude snakes. I'll be careful. Dude on the left. Uh, do you mean the white guy or the black guy? <laughs> The white guy? Um, I don't know why he seemed familiar. He's kind of based loosely on like 
Tom Cruise and some other types of uh, actors like that that got involved in cults and stuff. Um, but he, to my knowledge, he's not like, well, not to my knowledge, but he's like not a real person. Um, but like, we've also seen him several times already in this game. This was not our first time seeing him. So that might be why he seems familiar as well. Oh, out of range. Come on. All right, so we got to get closer. This should be fine. There's me. Closed circuit terminal. Ah, okay. Okay. All right, let's raise the helo up. Raise me up. Okay. Let's get me a bit closer. Nope, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Okay. All right. So where was the closed circuit terminal? Over there. Okay. Over there. All right. Well. Okay, so that's probably just a way out the other side. Y'all saw nothing. Aha! Here we go. But it's also locked to the closed circuit terminal, which is over there. Huck. Okay. Well, let's see. Oh, that doesn't help. Okay. Okay. Actually, this is not to outside. Ooh. Okay. Is this to garage? Is this to garage?
Is this two carrots? Um, there we go. Yay! Garage! There we go. Ooh, some nice cars in here. Ooh, look at those. Okay. Okay. Now I'm just gonna slip down here, open this, close that, that up. And then hide myself here. While I send this buddy back up this way. Wait. Let's check out some cameras first. Sensitivity on the mouse a little bit. Okay. Uh, do that. That. Okay. The internal network is unlocked. Huh. That's gotta be Jimmy's elevator. I've unlocked the secret lift. I can't believe you actually said that. What? It's true. Welcome to the fifth level of the new dawn, and congratulations on your spiritual ascendance. Thank you, I worked hard for it, says Marcus off screen. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> All right, so that's coming back up. I need to get him actually in there. All right. <clears throat> uh, 
that back too. He's busy now. So, oh. Before I go down there, I want to go pick that up. Come on, there you go. Bum, 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 ba, dum, ba. Stop worrying about me. Now we go down. These are some fancy ass tablets. We're looking at New Dawn's prized possessions. The foundation of their entire religion. Rows of ancient Sumerian tablets. There's a lot of crazy shit in here, but this, no, this, this is something special. Why aren't they in a museum? I mean, what gives the church the right to keep these hidden away from us? Let's find out. Oh, it says do not touch, but I really want to touch. I mean, just a little. Come on. <laughs> so much rich history. I mean, I am so glad to be a part of all the... Oh, no, 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 no! They're fucking fake. <laughs> this is all bullshit. People commit to New Dawn, pay millions of dollars before they get to see these, and they're fake. As fake as everything else the church promises. <clears throat> yeah. Now I feel better. Let's go home. Scientific experts. 
Sure it has. Sure. The fourth tablet explains our new dawn. We are all remnants of the visitor. Unique in form, a collective in purpose. We are the visitor seeds, blossoming and reseeding, reaching towards the heavens in a physical and spiritual path. Until one day we advance enough to reach another world and continue to spread into other galaxies. There is another story hidden within the text of the four tablets. Together, they speak of an end time, trillions of years in the future, where we will all be rejoined into the original form of the visitor. Well. Sec decided to dig into the church of the New Dawn and found crime and corruption at its core. They purchased large amounts of personal data to better target their enemies. They may already have a file on you. On you. We will proceed to leak everything we collected to our usual dispatches. Read them. Read them. Verify them. Verify. You will come to the same conclusion we did. New Dawn is a criminal organization designed to intimidate its own members into destroying their own lives and handing over their savings. Okay. But don't take our word for it. We have a celebrity guest. Yes. Hello, I'm Jimmy Siska. You probably remember me from a bunch of good movies I made before I was brainwashed by New Dawn and forced to tow the company line. When friends of mine questioned the church's cruel practices, they disappeared. When I questioned that, I was taken against my will and locked away. Know that the police are already investigating my claims. And what is the church all about? What's behind door number five? I'll let my friends in DedSec demonstrate. DedSec has given you the truth. Which of these cards should I take? Um, go with. It's a Papa Vero. Yeah, let's go with the Papa Vero. Yes, Hallelujah was playing on the game, Queen. It did seem that way. Marcus, you need to get back here right now. What's going on? Nothing good. Hurry. It does kind of seem out of character for the game. However, it makes a bit of sense when you think about the fact that uh, it was a church that I was in. Not a real church, a criminal organization that was pretending to be a church, but still. <laughs> that is very fair. Shit, 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 shit. Hey, man, shit, what's, shit. What, hey, what's going on? 
I was looking at our numbers, how many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we had available, and that's when I saw it. It, what, it, what? A chunk of our followers and bots came from inactive or dead invite accounts. Hey, wait, so someone used a social media site to boost our numbers? Who? And how many fucking accounts, I don't man? know who, but it came from inside invites. Someone with admin access, I'm sure of that. As for how many... Fuck Sorry. Me. Sorry, I didn't check. It's... No, it's all my fault. I didn't check. Josh, no, I didn't check. You know, maybe someone inside invite is a fan. Yeah, or maybe we're getting set up to get fucked. <laughs> we need to find out. Marcus. Find your way inside. I should've, I should've just Josh, tried. Josh, it's not your fault, okay? Look, we all saw the numbers. You're the only one who caught it. You did good. You did good. Oh, huh? Josh. Okay. Oh, I love Josh so much. All right, let me check my equipment real quick. All right, we got the air shotgun. Let's change that out for... Oh, wrong thing. Where is my... Sun sniper rifle, please, and thank you. Uh, so sexy, it hurts. All right, there's a stun launcher. Do I have enough money for that? Looks like I do. A stun grenade launcher, hell yeah. <clears throat> All right. Want the shotgun or the sniper rifle? Yeah, we'll do the sniper rifle because we have the grenade launcher for if shit hits the fan. Okay. All right. What's up, French? Marcus Holloway, scourge of the church. Come on, Marcus Holloway, bane of tablet fakery. Awful! Marcus Holloway, Duskbringer of the New Dawn. Oh, I like that one. Let's go I with like that, that one. one. Too. Half the time, I can't tell if shit is Darwin Award level stupidity or some asshole's idea of a marketing stunt. What are we talking about? This shit with invite. I don't like feeling used, Marcus. It makes me want to take a sledgehammer to limbs and jumper cables to soft body parts. I mean, <laughs> fair. No deal, man. Whatever comes next, we'll deal. Yeah, but my coping mechanisms involve breaking things. So just promise me that when the time comes, you'll let me blow shit up. <laughs> you got it. 
you always need a friend who's willing to blow shit up when he needs to. Hey, Josh. Marcus, I was just reading comments from DedSec members. Our New York members set fire to a new Dawn Center. Are we okay with that? That's what happens when you have a group with no rules or leaders. You can work towards a basic message, but you can't control every reaction. Our message on this one is right. You just have to be good with that. Yeah. Okay. I'm good with that. Are you good with that? Yeah. We're getting close now. This is gonna be huge. How does it feel, man? Feels good when things work. Just good? No, like, um, really good. So good. Feels so good. Okay, this just got a little creepy. Sorry. <laughs> Poor Josh. What's up? We're getting a lot of buzz. Hackers wanting to sign up with us, other groups wanting to rally banners. Well, that's some Game of Thrones shit, man. That's what got me worried, too. Won't take long before some troll tries to join up and hurt us from the inside. That's why we're taking so long, vetting new blood. Yeah, it pays to be safe. True. All right, nobody else seems to want to talk. Damn, Satara, why don't you want to talk? Nothing to say to me? Oh, she does want to talk. How's DedSec taking the new Dawn victory? Eating it up. Protests are going full force across the country, and people who aren't even associated are standing next to us. Couldn't have gone better. Well, not unless the church shut down completely. <laughs> we'll keep pushing until it does. With Miranda and Jimmy Siska on the front lines, Nudon's taking a huge hit. It's Fair. looking like Cyber Driver might wind up the surprise hit of the year. <laughs> well, we won't hold our breath for a thank you card from HMP. <laughs> nope. Apparently, our home CEO tested his new software on his own family. You're joking. His wife Ooh. filed for divorce this morning, citing illegal surveillance of a minor. Whoa, so he's looking at jail time? It's all conjecture right now, but it seems possible. Turns out, secretly spying on people tends to make them a little angry. Mm, who would have guessed? No. Who did? Yeah, exactly, Marcus. Who'd have guessed? This fake follower shit has me spooked. You're waiting for the other shoe to drop. I know. I'm feeling it, too. It's not just that. Okay, so yeah, what if someone else is playing us? What's bothering me is losing face. That'll cost us even more. How can we talk about pulling back the curtain when we're all tangled up in it? We can't talk about changing the system when we're still getting gamed by it. True. All right. One second. Wait, why am I running? <coughs> Excuse me, goddamn. Sending you the flagged accounts. Use the CEO's computer, Mary Catskill. She's on vacation, so her office should be empty. Invite basically Twitter or uh, Instagram or Facebook. Thank you. 
allow us to direct the news and social content of our users' feeds without their knowledge in order to better our business. The first of these emotional contagion tests spanned three months. Our client selections were based on political leaning, emotional stability rating, and amount of social contacts. The phase one goal was to see how easily we could shift the emotional state and post content of the least stable users. The results were astounding, a 96% success rate. By bombarding their feeds with negative news, content that questioned their worldviews, and reminders of moments shared with loved ones, divorced or deceased, we were able to generate feeds full of negative posts from our subjects. We had effectively changed their moods. To solidify our results, we were able to reset their emotional states by refilling their feeds with positive news and reminders. Shock. Social media experimenting on our brains. Shock. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. I unlocked the elevator, heading there now. <laughs> Phase two of Invite's emotional contagion testing presented a bigger challenge to us. Our goal was to take more business-focused users, those with less social media interaction, and attempt to shift their emotional profiles. Altering their news feeds and social reminders had little impact, as they primarily use Invite to promote their products. So we took a different approach. We focused on their businesses. Suggested sites and recommended articles were custom-tailored to each client, showing promotional material from their more successful competitors. We also focused on links to stories about major failures and bankruptcy in the client's field of work. While we saw no real change in post content, we saw clear impacts on their businesses, price drops, investment in training, and even layoffs. Social media manipulation. Oh, shocker. The shocking of the shockiest. <coughs> Trying to find the third one, but it might be upstairs. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 yeah, it looks like it's upstairs. Na, da, da. Hey, no way! Heading up. I'm gonna get us some answers. Good luck, Marcus. We're with you. Trying to figure out who boosted our numbers. Whoa, whoa. What happened? The flag clients just vanished. We lost the bots. What did you do? Nothing. This isn't me. I... Marcus. Is this a bad time? Sort of feels like a bad time. <clears throat> she drinks it with ice. <laughs> she drinks it with ice. <laughs> I don't really need to introduce myself, do I? I know who you are. That night at the beach, man, I knew you looked fucking familiar. Well, Venus must have been in retrograde or some bullshit because I think it was fate that I was in the night that you hacked into our system. 
I had to meet you, and there you were, pissing on your sneakers. All brains and no aim. What's Bloom's CTO doing in the office of the CEO of Invite? And why'd you boost our numbers? Uh, this is the part where you offer me a six-figure salary? <laughs> no, fuck no. No, no, no. You could coat circles around most of my programmers. No, see, I can't pitch uh, CTOS 2.0 as a state-of-the-art security system and then hire someone that's on the no-fly list. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I just came here to have a drink. But hey, if you want to have a drink and a dance, I'm in. Oh, you think it's a <coughs> fucking joke? Huh? Do it. Roll a fucking punch. <laughs> you got everybody eating out your fucking hands thinking the system's bulletproof? You can't see the people you're stepping on. Guess what, Marcus? Guess what? The people want to be told who is good and who is bad. They don't care how it works, only that it does. But it doesn't fucking work. A few fucking civilian casualties is the cost you have to pay for the betterment of the world. You're fighting a war no one gives a shit about. Now they're just swimming upstream right into the grizzly's mouth. So why'd you prop up dead sex numbers? No one in Silicon Valley could throw a proper punch. That, and you're a great investment. You're so aggressive, so indignant. You frightened the rest of Silicon Valley right to my doorstep. You use us to sell CTOS 2.0 to them. What is the ultimate deterrent against hackers like you? <coughs> How? Everyone needs my protection. So, here it is, Marcus. Your record is back on file. Your backdoor access is plugged. And those bots I gave you, they're gone. Oh, 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 and there's a warrant out for your arrest. Hacking, corporate espionage, and breaking and entering. It's OK. I was done with it anyway. Fuck. Calling units, air support requested to dispatch the squad. Be on alert. Possible hostiles near your location. <coughs> All units, this is squad. Air support be advised. We have reports of a violent criminal near your location. Over. I got plenty. Fuck! Cops are surrounding the building. Get out of there. Fuck! Marcus, they're surrounding the building. Get pissed later and get out now. I repeat, come out with your hands up. All right, all right, I'm, I'm gone. That was a car, not not a road. There we go. Squad, we have eyes on the suspect and are in pursuit. Uh, looks like suspect is gone. We 
advised a patrol SUV has been sent to the suspect's location. Out from sky view. Copy that. We... A patrol SUV is en route to the suspect. Yep. Squad, we're on location and searching for the suspect now. Oh my god! Marcus, it's getting too hot out there for you. Come back. We'll figure this out together. from the stripper on the pole. Hey, Retro, what's up? Just killing time, you? I was hoping to catch my cousin here, but he didn't show. I think we might have something for dead sec. Oh, yeah? I'm listening. He buys his weed from the anti shoes. Has for years. So he's gotten close to a couple of them. He heard them talking about a deal with the Broadvest to move product. Yeah, I don't think dead sex got a horse in that race. He doesn't think it's drugs this time. They're moving people. OK, that changes things. Where can I dig into this? I'll send you a location where the shoes hang out. Somebody there will know more. What? Okay. okay I just learned about some kind of gangster swap meet. Shoes and Bratva. Why do you want to anger two different homicidal crime groups at the same time? Because everybody loves a vigilante. Actually, public opinion is pretty mixed on them. Not for dead sex target audience. We keep making trouble for the indisputable bad guys. We gain followers. It's easy math. Your math is sound there. I'm gonna pay the shoes a visit and see what I can find out. Eight second, there we go. Let's go take my anger out oh, at no. Bloom on uh, gangs. Hey, you! Hi, yes. yeah! <sighs> Fuck face! Feel better? Step <sighs> off! Fucking douche! You starting <sighs> this? Creep! <sighs> uh, a San Francisco group of hackers has exposed New Dawn's religious secrets. DedSec revealed footage of New Dawn's temple area and demonstrated that the so-called ancient artifacts were simply fakes of what New Dawn claimed were ancient tablets. Members of the hacker group managed to infiltrate the highly guarded compound and capture the secretive organization's methods of control over members, including movie star Jimmy Siska. New Dawn declined our requests for an interview. All right. Up the area out. You should have been back by now. Any word from them? No answer. I'm worried about the deal. Where was the brat for meat? Sending it to you. Get your people out there and salvage this.
Looks like the Brafa shoe deal may have gone south. Dead end? Maybe not. I'm not giving up on this one yet. I got an itch. Just don't get yourself killed trying to scratch it. <laughs> That's quiet. Okay, let me get my car, my bike. Hold on a second, let me look. There's a research point here. The hack, okay. Come on. Come on. Research point here. I'll worry about that another time. None of the buttons that I meant to push. Damn, I missed the deal. There's nobody here. Maybe there never was a deal. Nah, it looks like something bad went down. This is a crime scene. I'm gonna look closer. Oh, I do see some blood, actually. Yep, there's all the corpses. Listen, Aiden Pierce is coming your way. Psycho's falling threads out of Quinn's fuck up in Chicago. You need to get the fuck out of there right now. Aiden Check Pierce! GPS, meet us there. We're gonna try to trap him. Hope you got this entire. Fucking Aiden Pierce. Coming from San coming from Chicago to San Francisco. Holy shit, people. What? This is Aiden Pierce's work. What are you talking about? I found bodies, shoes, and Bradford. Aiden Pierce is taking them down, and I'm in the middle of it. The Chicago vigilante? That's him. He's heading into a trap. Gotta help him. All right. Now, where is this heading me over here? Ah. Okay. Well, I'm gonna... Fast travel down there. That's interesting. Okay. Get my
it's in here. Stairs. Okay. Intrusion detected. Looks like Pierce really got himself into a jam. Don't just tell us about it, help him! Look at him go. Like yeah, a boss. Yeah, baby, I'm out of here. Yeah, da, da, na, na, da, na, 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 na. Guys, I just did a tag team with Aiden Pierce. You're kidding me. Nah, it was definitely him, the Fox. Did you get a picture? No, I don't want him coming after me. The man is intimidating as hell. Took down mafia, street gangs. He stopped a human trafficking operation by himself. I thought you said it was a tag team. Hey, he'd be dead if it wasn't for me. Uh-huh. What? I'm, I'm serious. I saved his bacon. Totally a tag team. Totally a tag team. Fuck! Fucking! Fuck! It's not that bad. We look like a bunch of chumps. God fucking damn it! Wrench, calm the fuck down. It's not helping. Yeah, you're right. It's not helping. Marcus, you got anything to say? Well, guys, I, to be honest with you, uh, I genuinely don't have a plan. But I got an idea, and I don't know, just trust me on this one. Things haven't been great lately. Yeah, they suck. But whatever shit we're in now, that's now. You helped us find our voice. We took on the Giants and had one motherfucker of a run. Never thanked you for any of it. Hey, why are you talking like it's over? Isn't it? I'm still in. I know you are, and we can convince the others that you're not in. These are from our DeadSec channels. DeadSec is not worthy. DeadSec is a bunch of skiddies. You told us lies and bullshit. Hashtag DeadSuck. Yeah, so we got some shit stirrers. Who cares what they think? Who cares what they... Jesus, Marcus. Have you been paying attention? I care what they think. I've worked my ass off for years, trying to earn us respect long before you ever showed up. This is my brand. Now it's completely fucked. 
so unfuck it. I don't know if I can. Uh, well, if it makes you feel any better, at least you're not a fugitive. <laughs> oh, damn. I wonder if there's a bounty on your head. Maybe I can salvage this. Oh, please. Hey, you couldn't catch me if you wanted oh, to. Oh, you're talking to a track star, bitch. Yeah. 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 Welcome to Burning Man. <laughs> if I gotta drag the asses out to the middle of the desert to keep DeadSec together, I'm gonna do it. DeadSec's come too far to give up now. Hey, pleasure to meet you. Yeah, you too. What's going on here? I'm trying Marnie. very hard These not to get myself my in trouble. We're all firefighters, man. <laughs> FDH 13 blaze breakers. Here in case the fires get out of control? Hell no. We're out here to start them. What brings you out to the middle of fucking nowhere? <laughs> I'm here with my crew too. Bonding, you know. Well, you came to the right place. Just remember to use protection. <laughs> yeah, I'll do that. Thanks. I mean, fair. All right. What we got here? My poem, The Eternal Questions. What is Silicon Valley? What is the cost of living in Silicon Valley? Why should we move to Silicon Valley? Why am I failing to get an interview in Silicon Valley? I mean... Arrogance. My entry is called Loss. I had toes. I stared at them and they disappeared. I had fingers. I stared at them and they disappeared. I'm not available for parties. Don't let them put a battery in me. Don't let them attack. 
such wires. Don't let them dig the archaeology of my mind. Spiders. This is called awkward. Your little guy is really quite shy, but once exactly, in a while, queen. he'll come out to say hi. Not when I want him, but you know that's okay. It's good he gets practice, so he's ready to play. <laughs> this is old bro to a dude bro. Old bro to Double a dude bro. At your faux hawk, I can only sneer. Six pack abs and iron pecs. Brags about vaginas wreck. <laughs> I guess this is my entry. I call it Swelter Skelter has sold out. I was here at the beginning when this place was about the tribe about celebrating our connection to each other and to the earth spirit but now with all this tech and loud music it's just another loud corporate sponsored shit festival and the ticket prices are too high next year i'm not buying a ticket although you won't care because you sell out every year because you are all about selling out screw swelter skelter and screw you sellouts he says in a poetry contest at Swelter Skelter. Which is Burning Man. In this my entry for the world. Man's Home contest. I call it unfulfilled. Duck. 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 <laughs> Duck. 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 That's actually pretty fucking clever and I love it. Here's my bad pun entry. I call it boob. If you boob. Think that I'm rude when I look at your boob. <laughs> I just like tits. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't think I've resonated with a poem more. your friend oh this is susan she's a second grade teacher from milwaukee she's 32 and she drives a cherry red cool hey we're gonna meet by the big sculpture for a group shot before the challenge um whenever you're ready didn't mean to uh step on your game here game uh we're not playing a game i was just explaining to susan how if you're Low speed mixture adjustment is too rich, your engine's going to buckle under all the excess fuel. That's a four cycle idle, and that can be a no no. Yep, sure can. Okay, well, I'll see you out there. Josh, how do you like Swelter Skelter? It's very warm, but the people are nice. <laughs> I can see that. Josh, how do you like Swelter Skelter? It's very warm. <laughs> Recently divorced, too.
Don't think you'll find the answer out there, Marcus. I found the edge of the map, y'all. Hey. Washington. Is that your name? Adams. All right. Jefferson. So you're naming our presidents in order. This is some kind of our thing? Madison. Monroe. Adams. Jackson. Jackson. <laughs> I get you, man. I get you. Van Buren. What? <laughs> I like what you're doing here. Thanks, Obama. <laughs> I like what you're doing here. Thanks, Obama. Man. Thanks, Obama. It's Satara doing her art. Leaving your mark? Always. But not dead sex. Doesn't feel right, you know? Come on, don't bum me out here. I'm trying to have a good time. Me too. So we, as in dead sex we, are gonna enter that hacking challenge and we're gonna win. And the others are okay with this? They will be. I got a nice smile. Well, you do have a nice smile. <laughs> See? No problem. We're gonna do this. Everything's gonna be okay. You've got it all figured out, huh? Nah, but I do know if I get you back in Satara mode, you'll figure out most of it for me. <laughs> Damn, you are dangerous. <laughs> Meet us by the ugly sculpture when you're ready. All right, see you there. You ever think about going commercial? Sure, I'll set up a little shop on the internet, sell chibi stickers, little doggy t-shirts. I'd buy some chibi stickers. No. <laughs> you ever think about going commercial? Sure. I'd buy. No. No. <laughs> All these people over here doing like exercise. Oof. How's the party going? Say something random. Okay, uh, beer is oil for the human machine. Bwomp. Oh, damn! You just inception bwomped me! Bwomp. Humanity's fate now lies at the fingertips of a single hacker. Bwomp. Pineapple pizza is the stuff of nightmares. Bwomp. <laughs> Thanks for this. I feel epic now. Bwomp. What the hell? Womp. Womp. Huh? Womp. Hey man, what you working on? Gonna get these people moving. But they need a proper track list. This shit barely has a pulse. DJ ratio. Just ratio. Back when I used to do sets. Hey, maybe I'll go back to it. What else am I gonna do now? Man, dead sex not over. We hit a pothole, that's all. We're gonna come back stronger. You're always so sure of yourself. I know, but I'm always right. Wait, wait, wait. Here we go. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's much better. Locked their DJ out of his tools, too. The savior of the party. Hey, once you're done giving these guys a hard time, meet me in the middle. Dead sex entering a competition. I'll be there. Taking requests? Hell no. All right. Something smells good. Sun-fried dillo with chili powder. As in armadillo? Yep. Carried him up from Texas. Just threw him on a slab of metal and the desert did the rest for us. It's safe to eat? I'm not dead yet, so I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take your word for it. Don't take my word for it. Take a bite. I've got extra. I can't. I'm on a religious fast. Thanks, though. You're lost, my friend. Aww.
Change your mind? How about I pack you a little Dillo bag for when your fast is over? Uh, no, you know what? You keep it and enjoy it. <laughs> Drag you out in the middle of the desert and make you wear a wedding dress? Never. You know what I mean. I did three months of extra hauls to pay for that. That's fucking awesome. But that's not right. All right. So let's sell the bike and buy you a big ass bouquet of flowers. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. I'll bust out of a cape wearing nothing but a re engagement ring. Really? Oh, you do that for me? I mean, it's going to be a tiny ring. Is it going to fit on my Yo. Ouch. Ouch. Brutality. <laughs> murdered that guy in front of us fuck okay we're back to her oh we didn't talk to this guy welcome to the festival here take a bloom flyer i'm good what does Bloom have to do with this? Dusan Nemec is personally sponsoring the event this year. Bloom is providing transportation to and from the desert. Air-conditioned trailers, VIP bungalows. Oh, yeah? Where do I find those? Well, they're over in the exclusive camp. This is the desert, man. There's no exclusive out here. Fuck your flyers. You should be ashamed. Come on. I don't even work for Bloom. Shame! Yo, poor guy. Shame! Go away! <laughs> Shame! Go away! I do feel bad for that guy, though. Like he said, he doesn't even work for Bloom. <clears throat> right, we've been in there. Been through there. Oh, hi. That's cool. What do you call it? Oh, I, I try not to devalue my work with names. It's just another small burst of creativity in an ocean of passing thoughts. See, that sounds like a good title. Passing thoughts. Oh, no. That, uh, that's not the title. How about small bursts? No, I told you. It doesn't have a name. It's untitled. Isn't untitled basically a title? I never thought about that. Huh. Well, you may be onto something, like how many paintings out there are untitled? And if we look at them all together as a whole, they do share a title. The Collective Remnants of Works Without Nomenclature. I like that, Collective Remnants. No, that is not the title. <laughs> I love him just fucking with people. Can I give it a name? No, it doesn't have a name. Oh, hey. Yeah, the workout twins again. Here's the dance party again. We didn't check over here, though. Whoa, bro. Don't fail on us yet. Something. Whoa, bro. Don't bail on us yet. We're on to something. All right, let's go talk to Wrench. This is the last one. Fair fight. Oh, it's so not fair. 
Little guy's gonna get the shit kicked out of him. But that's what makes it fun, right? You like to watch a little guy take his lumps. Yeah. I mean, so he can get back up on his feet again and overcome, right? You're trying to turn this into a metaphor for Dead Set, aren't you? I mean, if you want to keep Dead Set going, I'm right there with you. But if you're putting your metaphor money on that weirdo, no. He's going down and staying down. <laughs> yeah, it's a long shot. Hey, are you joining us for the competition? Yep, I'm down. Oh, shit! Battle <laughs> Cry! Let's kick some ass! Give me an Yeesh! Oh shit! Yeesh! Alright, let's group up with the friends. Alright, people, gather up. We need a group shot. Hey, try to look pretty for the camera, huh? Always. Okay, looks like the challenge is starting. Hey, Josh, get on the numbers and feed it answers. Wrench, got the jab of one. Get it wired up and ready. Ratio, I need you to run an appearance on a rival. Slow him down. Satori and I are gonna hack this thing. <laughs> Let's get it. Dead set. Let's go, guys. Drone's up there if you need a better I'm inside. Oh. Almost there. Okay, what is this? <laughs> nice. Throwing up the horns and punctuating them. We should focus. There seems to be a timer. Think you can hack it? Of course. Stop fucking moving. Don't mess with Zatara. Got a spinner. Shit. Let me fix that for you. Thanks. It's good. Ah. T Boone! The kids want to feed your heads? Two ounces of sacrosanct mind fuck. T Bone! We had Aiden Pierce and now we got T Bone. People, I am going offline now. And now they're all high as fuck. Oh, Horatio, you good, man? The word good has lost all meaning, my friend. Mm. Okay, you good? Mm. Did I forget to mention that these boomers had a little acid bath? Uh, Josh, 
It's okay, they're using hallucinogens in clinical trials for mass bees. Mass, mass bees. <laughs> Josh is feeling it. Okay, let's go find something for you to stare at. Huh? Okay. Okay. Come on. Raymond Kenny. T Bone. You're not Ray. You were Ray, Raymond Kenny Ray. I, I still got your old hacker zines, man. I remember reading War Driver and gearing up my 10 speed, backpack with an antenna. Shit, I even used your old root kit, man. Fuckster? Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> well, I assumed you were all just skitty pests. Correct me if I'm wrong, but your crew seems to have a lot of unfocused noise. You the leader? <laughs> no, man, it doesn't work like that. Dead sex got a rule. No personal armies, no leaders. Yeah. Well, FYI, I saw you leading out oh, there. Man, this is everything we're fighting against. The system back home is completely fucked. And any kid out there on the sand is gonna say the exact same fucking thing. Easy words, bro. Easy words. All right. A few years ago, this broken-ass system marked me as a criminal risk. Linked me to some shit I didn't even do because it was probable. And now, with CTOS, it's everywhere. I mean, I, I can see it down to the... <laughs> the to the sub subliminal shit. You just multiply. Yeah, we have a tendency to do that. Yeah, we have a tendency what to do, do that. What subliminal is a bellwether, Marcus. You got a short eye, kid. But subliminal is passive. Bellwether program is control. It's like a Orwell hooks with double punch. Profile. Media manipulation, corporate collusion, consumerism, all driven by predictive algorithms. And now, it's setting up shop in the heart of the Silicon Valley. And somebody at Bloom's using CTOS to feed it data. You're recruiting. He's dressed like the Mad Hatter. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, Marcus, wake the fuck up. Let's Boy, go. Man. Uh, I just spent the night in a pup tent next to a lady who was very nude and very tattooed. Oh, good for you, girl. No, you don't get it, man. She was a son's of Ragnarok bride. I guess we gotta go, man. We gotta fucking vamoose now. Come on. Fucking sons are coming. Oops. Wow. So you said you guys fucked up. How bad is it? Yeah, we all at risk now because my name's got a red flag on it. Yeah, people are gonna start making the connections. Yeah, where the fuck is everyone? Is that all? It's enough. We talking about Bloom here. Hey, and you're talking to Bloom's public enemy number one, son? Yeah, well, I've been dodging those two. bastards for years. Aiden Pierce. If you want, I could scrub you oh, from the again. system. Give me a couple hours. Just like that? Well, I might have to sacrifice a goat as part of my arcane ritual, but yeah, just like that. <laughs> there you are. We've been looking for you all morning. Turns out Swelter Skelter doesn't have a lost and found. <laughs> nah, it's more of a finder's keeper's policy out there in the desert. What in the hell is he doing here? Yeah, Marcus, why did you invite this stranger into our house? Look, look, it just happened, all right? We were running from these bikers, right? Yeah. And... Look, you know what? It doesn't even matter. He's cool. 
Oh, he's cool. Well, that's good. Because we usually discuss these things as a group. I know. It's my bad. But you met Ray already, right? I want to introduce you to Raymond Kinney. That's Raymond Kinney? I thought you'd be... Cleaner? Cleaner. Yeah, I get that a lot. Can Josh? I have a hug? Oh, uh, Josh! Yeah, I have a two-second room. Oh, Josh! I get this a lot, too. Can we keep him, Josh. like, a hacker in residence? Yeah, we could oh. use his help. Can we keep him? Oh, he, he, he can stay here, right? He should... He should stay here. I love okay, Josh. fine. But if he fucks with any of us, I'm gonna pop his nuts like ripe grapes. Message received. Nice hat. Nice mask. <laughs> okay, we're good. You want a beer? Uh, yeah. I would love a beer. Or two. Oh, thank yeah. you. Grab the man some hardware, too. He's gonna teach us some magic. Josh being like, can, 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 can I have a hug? <laughs> like, I fully get Satara being pissed. And she ain't talking to me. Fair. Valid. Oh, now she'll talk to me. Hey, level up! Score. All right, before I talk to her, let's do some leveling up here. <coughs> Let me get that jump boost fucking finally and you know what while i'm here let's get that speed boost too hell fucking yes all right okay now let's talk to satara hello if we had stayed here pissed off depressed hell lost this group would be gone you're the new guy and you managed to keep our collective shit together hey we're a team right thanks to you okay i get it stop you don't like praise do you you wonderful wonderful man <laughs> you glorious hero you stop god i love her <laughs> hey kid ready to change the world i got something for you Marcus, I need your help. Sure, man. What is it? I picked up a rash or something Marcus, from Swelter's Marcus, check Celtic. out these texts I pulled from I the I noodled it, and of course, Dr. Noodle's telling me it's ovarian cancer or something equally horrifying, but I wanted to get a second opinion on it. <clears throat> I, I think maybe somebody else in the group could help you with that. Come on. Josh would just share it with everybody, and there's no way Satara's going to look under there. Nope. This is the nope situation. Some friend you are. <laughs> Uh, one of our newbie followers reported something strange. Anybody heard about a bunch of funky rat masks hanging around outside the MoMA? Bunch of self-described art anarchists calling themselves the Ordinate Academy. Rodentia Academy. It's an anagram. Good catch. What's their platform? Total transparency. No privacy for anybody. Then why the masks? These rat masks. What do they look like? Stylish. Low poly. Fuck. That's default. Default? The musician? Default, the ex-deadsec hacker. Default, the psychopath asshole who tried to gas me in his fucked up spook show house. Okay, I'm definitely gonna check these guys out then. Gives me a chance to meet one of the new followers, too. Cryptogram? I was obsessed with these things as a kid. Damn, that takes me back. Think you still got it? I'd love it if Dad said could one up the cops on this. Our followers would eat it up. You just give me that cryptogram, son, and I'll see what I can do. Now that we've got Raymond Kenny, all of the DLC is kicking in, which is what that was. Oop. The, not all of it, but a lot of it. So we've got Limp Noodle, uh, Rodentia Academy. Zodiac Killer. Yeah. All right. You got something to say? No? Okay. Already talked to him. Okay. 
Horatio's got nothing to say. And Josh, what you got to say? So Josh, what'd you think about your first Swelter Skelter? I think mushrooms have opened up some very promising avenues for me, so I've got a few grow kits on the way. I had a hard time choosing between Mazatepec and White Lightning, but I'll find the strongest effect by process of elimination. These are only two of a dozen solid options, so I'm gonna have a busy year. You need any help testing those? I'm your man. Thank you, Marcus. <laughs> Always happy to help. <coughs> Hey, yo, T-Bone, I'm ready, man. I'm pumped. No, seriously, activist mode, activate. Hey, man, how do we get Bloom? <laughs> what? Hold on to your joystick, son. You kids are gonna need to work your way up to Bloom, even with me helping. Ray, are you briefing him without me? We were supposed to do that together. Oh, uh, no, I just didn't want to trouble you. What trouble? No trouble. Come on, Marcus, let's brief. Tara is a little salty. Okay. So let's that... look at the big shot data harvester. Our friends at Noodle. Now, every time you search for discount refrigerator or bulldozer porn, they learn more and more about you. Data profiling 101. Uh, right. But what you didn't know was that Bloom's already got their grubby paws all over that data. Oh, shit. Oh, this is good, Sitar. Noodle's data is just what Bloom needs to strengthen the bellwether, dig their puppet strings in deeper. You know, if we could get a hold of this ammunition, we could take down a whole lot of different targets. I can help with that. You can't hack Noodle unless you get into the server farm. You can't get into the server farm without clearance. Hell, you can't even get on the grounds unless you're an employee there. Who the hell you think Rob Zombie over here gets his intel from? Tell me you got clearance. <laughs> Oh, man, I'm trying to stay low-key right now. One of my leads is breathing down my neck. Hey, Yvonne, okay, thanks for the lurk. Pose as an employee? Oh, he could do more than pose as an employee, Sitara. Tell him what you told me, Horatio. Noodle buses. I snagged an exploit for credentials. I could get you to the buses. All you got to do is drive it in. They'll think you're one of the bus drivers. Shit. Yo, let's roll, son. All right. Hey. <laughs> mm-hmm. Let's do this. Hey, not the fucking dance. <laughs> Horatio says Noodle is a master at compartmentalization. There's no way he has any idea what other R&D they're doing there. Always got to be the first to know, huh? I'm tracking their patents, and the only one that looks exciting to me is autonomous hover cars. Finally! What's up? So what happens when we finish here? What's next for the great Ray Kinney? Well, I suppose Frewer and I will move on to... Oh, fuck! What? Oh, I left Frewer in the Frewer desert. I Frewer in the desert, poor What's Frewer! Many scientists have worked hard to figure that out with no <laughs> conclusive results. Anyway, don't worry about me, kid. You ever need a hand with anything, I'm in. Oh, you have a bat signal or something? No, but I'm adding that to my to-do list. I feel oh, like I'm Tobias. chasing Bloom around the damn country, man. Meanwhile, they think they're chasing me. Might be a smart move. They're not expecting you to come here. The smart move is to keep moving. But I'm not known for always making smart moves, anywho. Second, there we go. Okay. Horatio's gone. Let's go talk to Wrench. Horatio says Noodle has free salads, fruit, and smoothies. All healthy shit is free. All sugar lovers pay cash. What's next? Only hire vegans who wear blue? They get a chef to cook their lunch, too. What? Oh, come on. That's some elitist shit right there. Horatio didn't mention that. Maybe he could bring you a doggy bag. I'll take two. <laughs> Ray's been filling me in on what he knows about that bellwether, Algo. I gotta say, 
It's weirding me out more than I thought. The facial recognition, the emotional mapping, and Noodle's flood of data. This isn't even just predictive analytics. This is, this is like... I know. It freaks me out, too. And it's been around for a while now. How deep does it go? And how far has it spread? All right. Check a check, take a gander at the map. All right, we could meet for the noodle thing, or we could go do. I don't think I want to start the noodle thing yet. Uh, I don't want to do default yet. Um, hold on. That gap. <sighs> Okay, it looks like the only options at the moment are those three, so let's do the Zodiac Killer. All right, and that takes me over here. Hey, uh, anybody here seen a cryptogram laying around? Asking for a friend. Interesting strategy. The attached cryptogram, our code breakers are stumped. All right, T-Bone, here you go. Oh, this looks so familiar. Can you solve it? Uh, not right this minute. Stuff takes time. Any other info you can find would help. Do they, do they have a key? I'll look around. Great. Cops are working with Prime 8 to crack the cryptogram. If you ever needed proof the cops don't know what they're doing, no way Prime 8's getting cred for this. I'll find out what they know. Can't be much. with the red one. The red one! Woo! Oh, oh! 
Well, that person's dead. Sorry! Note to self, that, that wasn't a road. Poor car. Hold on a second. Let me make sure I'm going the right way. I am not. This poor car. It was so pretty. And now it's so shitty. Like I drove it off a cliff or something. Pardon me, coming through. And bump. Hey, look, primate. Lenny's convinced it's a message from someone. Who? She wouldn't say. Set up two. Hey, anybody heard of a data outpost in San Francisco? I read something the other day about an oil refinery that integrated some new data crunching tech. Came from Galilee, I think. Why does an oil refinery need a supercomputer? Marcus, if we leach some of that processing power, I can break this cryptogram lickety-fucking-splickety. Gotta doing? find another way to get in there. Okay, well, there's that. Ah. Sorry to break up the dance party, y'all. 911, please state your emergency.
Okay, where's the access point? Never mind, I'll find it. All right, Ray, get ready for the thunder. You feel the thunder, Ray? Oh, it's a thing of beauty. <laughs> and we're done. Broke the cryptogram already? <laughs> All right, boys and girls, we beat the police. It's a set of coordinates and a message. Follow me. Somebody's got a playful side. Send me the coordinates. Ah, uh, kid, this doesn't feel kosher. Thanks, Dad. I'll be cool. Thanks, Dad. The, the crane is what I need. All right. Now, it wants me to go over here. Okay. Woo! My bad. Shit, Marcus. I mean, I know I am literally holding down the boost button, but still. Calm yourself, my dude. Zodiac Killer? He's back? That's not possible. I was a teenager when Zodiac was on the loose. He'd have to be at least 70 now. If he's even still alive. Whoever this asshole is, he's killing people. 
and he's challenging us. What do you think of this, Ray? Just a sec. God. Okay. There. something in particular so long I can fuck get down ah. hey get lost I'm listening dog Then leave me alone. Let me steal this car. We have an alert on a possible felon near your location. Over. Be advised, units are en route to the suspect's location. I mean, this was unnecessary. This was just fun. <laughs> Keep an eye out. It's gotta be nearby. I'm having too much fun with this. You're not gonna find me. No, you ain't gonna find me. Y'all ain't gonna find me anymore. You're not gonna find me. No, you ain't gonna find me. You ain't gonna find me anymore. I may have started a gang war with the police. I'm kind of okay with that. You don't give a shit about me. Lol.
Ah, yes, the wonderful sounds. Of a gang war. Come on, go in the hole. Drone, go. Buddy, go in. Buddy, in. In. Buddy! In the hole! In the hole. In the hole! Please! <clears throat> Let's go back to what we were here for. Oh, the got called back. Okay. Oh, apparently I have to be there in person. Fine. Not make the selfie mode. Uh, how do I change that back camera? There we go. All right, and this is the Zodiac speaking. I'm not happy to. Oh fuck! I didn't mean to do that. Ray, what was it like when Zodiac was around? I was ten years old when I first heard of the Zodiac killer. Even all the way in upstate New York, we always thought. All right, Queen. Have a good night. This guy Sleep well. Making your blood Thanks for cold. tuning in. Nah, kid, this ain't Zodiac. This ain't Zodiac. All right. That's not where I wanted. Yeah, okay, fine. Yeah, it's not giving me any ability to listen to the audio again. Damn. Oh, well. All right, where's the next one? Over here. Station spot right here. Which is the one that's closest? That one. Okay, um... Vehicular. Puppy? Yeah, pet the puppy! Puppy! Okay. 
Hey, dog. Hey, dog. What's up? All right. All right, I am going to car on demand. Sorry guys, was not was not looking at the screen. Oh, right, this one. That's a big puzzle that I'm not going to mess with tonight. Or at least on stream. I might do it later after stream, but yeah. Okay. It is not a simple thing.
There we go. Okay. Damn. Here you go, Ray. Oh, come on, girl. Keep it together. Together. God, my computer's burning up. Fuck! My PC's cooked. Get on another one. It's no use. I've lost my connection to the data outpost. Not that it was fucking helping us particularly, but... Guys, guess who I found on invite? No. This is the Zodiac speaking. My kindred spirit would not share me with you all. He deserves a hole in the head. I am the killer of over a dozen people. Next target is planned. The death machine is already made. Can we track him using his invite account? We'll need a signal boost. He's proxied himself to hell and back. He could be anywhere. Well, <sighs> times have changed. No longer need in many places. Pot is legal to smoke in public. Marcus, that was cool, but I want you up the building. Can you? Fine, don't. Damn it. Climb the thing. Up over the. Marcus! Climb. Up. There you go. Up. Okay, that's a, those are two physical hacks. All right, and I'm in the wrong building. Okay. Excuse me, God damn. Okay. Ladder. Perfect. Here. 
up. Ladder. Invite is blowing up over Zodiac. Everyone's trying to find out who he is. Conspiracy theories out the ass. I've got footage of a junior senator denying it's him. We'll find out who it is. Take the fucker to task. Shit! He just uploaded a new audio file. This is the Zodiac speaking. I await my kindred spirit so he can witness my next kill. I think I shall use a bomb. That will cheer me up. My kindred spirit and I have much in common. We are both retro. Well, fuck me sideways. Was that retro comment directed at me? How does he know I'm after him? Don't let it get you. Just get to the top of the tower. Okay, so that's where I go. Okay. Yeah, there was nowhere else to go, so... Next, okay... There we go. I had to blow up the fence. That's what it was. There we go. Oh, no, retro. Pay attention. Retro, pay attention. Come on. Come on, Marcus. Up, up, up. There you go. Now, over here first. Alright, that should give you some extra juice. It's not that simple. We need more than one access to produce a sweep of the city. You want me to hack another cell tower? That's what I said. Already on it. <laughs> oh, 
All right, you're in. It'll take some time to bypass these proxies. We'll be in touch. Okay. Marcus, we finally pinned down his GPS. We have him. Get this. He's at Alcatraz. Alcatraz? What the hell is he doing there? Waiting for you. <gasps> Oops. Misclicked. Second. Sorry. There we go. That's where I was looking for. Okay. Alcatraz is out here. All right. Big travel. <laughs> Search the fuck away. Now. Before I do this, I'm going to go grab this shirt over here. It'll let me. Holy shit. Yeah. 
Well, that was gruesome. Fuck! Unbelievable! We can't find out who this guy is? Still, we stopped him. That counts for something. She's right, amigo. He only offed himself because you found him. Good work. For the record, I am not that freak's kindred spirit. You guys solved his cryptograms and shit. It's all right, man. Let it go. Algorithms, Calm more problems. All right, that's where we're gonna call it for the day. I'm gonna pop into this pawn shop, empty pockets and stuff, earn some cash. Can I um, help you? Oh, refill ammo. Okay, because apparently Maybe I used some time. ammo. Um, but uh, yeah, that's where we're gonna call it for today. Um, thanks for tuning in and hanging out with me as I continue our progress through Watch Dogs 2. Um, tomorrow is Thursday, and so there will no be, be no stream from me. However, feel free to check out one of these amazing people I have listed up here. And if you're not, if, uh, if you're looking for even more recommendations than those six, I have even more recommendations in the link tree below. If, speaking of this link tree, if you go to it, you'll find links to my socials, my Discord, my Instagram, my Patreon, which is also listed right here, and my YouTube, where you can check out my streams um for free a week after uh you oh, a week after they are live uh on twitch um and if you go to that patreon which again right there patreon.com slash crimson night um you will and if you choose to subscribe to me uh there is only one tier for a dollar a month um and uh that Goes sorry, my brain just alt F forward in the middle of a thought. That goes to a, a long way to uh, help me out and help my stream. Um, and uh, yeah, um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else. No, no, no. We'll be back on Friday with. Uh, night in the woods um with more night in the woods um but uh yeah i hope you all have a great rest of your week and i will see you all friday but in the meantime remember to have empathy be kind be safe love yourselves and love everyone around you and i will see you all next time i love you all peace out